Budesonide, found in rhinocord allergy aerosol, is used to prevent and treat seasonal and year-round allergy symptoms, such as stuffy or runny nose, itchy eyes, nose, or throat, and sneezing. It belongs to a class of drugs known as corticosteroids, which work by reducing swelling and inflammation in the nasal passages. The recommended dosage for adults is two sprays in each nostril once daily. It is best to take this medication at the same time each day for the best results. When using this medication, it's important to follow the instructions carefully. For over-the-counter use, make sure to read all the directions on the package before using. If prescribed by a doctor, be sure to read the patient information leaflet before starting and ask your doctor or pharmacist if you have any questions. This medication is meant for use in the nose, typically with one or two sprays in each nostril once or twice a day as directed by your doctor. Be sure to avoid spraying it in your eyes, and gently blow your nose before use. Remember to shake the container before each use and follow the instructions to prime the spray pump if it's your first time using it or if you haven't used it in a while. To use the spray, remove the plastic cap, close one nostril, and insert the nasal applicator into the other nostril. Press down firmly on the pump while breathing in through your nose, and then repeat in the other nostril. Be sure to follow the dosage instructions based on your age, medical condition, and response to treatment. This medication may not work right away, and it could take up to two weeks to feel the full benefit. It's important to use the medication regularly at the same time each day for the best results. If after two weeks, you don't see improvement or if your condition worsens, stop using the medication and consult your doctor or pharmacist. Some common side effects of rhinocord allergy aerosol, spray with pump include nose-slash-throat dryness, irritation, cough, sneezing, nosebleeds, or an unpleasant taste-slash-smell. If any of these side effects persist or worsen, it's important to consult your doctor or pharmacist. Although rare, serious side effects may occur, such as loss of taste or smell, pain-slash-sores in your nose, or signs of too much corticosteroid absorption into the bloodstream. If you experience unusual-slash-extreme tiredness, weight loss, headache, swelling ankles-slash-feet, increased thirst-slash-urination, or vision problems, contact your doctor immediately. Corticosteroids in this medication may weaken the body's ability to fight infections, making you more susceptible to serious infections or worsening any existing infections. If you notice signs of infection, such as a sore throat that doesn't go away, ear pain, fever, chills, or white patches inside the nose or on the back of the throat, it's important to seek medical attention. While rare, a serious allergic reaction to this medication may occur. If you experience symptoms such as rash, itching slash swelling of the face slash tongue slash throat, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing, seek medical help immediately. It's important to note that this is not a complete list of possible side effects. If you experience any other effects not listed here, consult your doctor or pharmacist. Before using rhinocord allergy aerosol, spray with pump, Make sure to inform your doctor or pharmacist if you have any allergies, as this product may contain inactive ingredients that could cause allergic reactions. It's also important to discuss your medical history, including any eye problems, infections, or recent nose issues, with your doctor or pharmacist before using this medication. Avoid close contact with anyone who has a contagious infection, and talk to your doctor if you have been exposed to an infection. If you need to undergo surgery or emergency treatment, make sure to inform your healthcare provider that you are using or have used this medication in the past. It's also important to let your doctor know about all the products you use, including prescription drugs, non-prescription drugs, and herbal products, before undergoing surgery. Additionally, if you are pregnant or breastfeeding, be sure to discuss the use of rhinocord allergy aerosol, spray with pump with your doctor to understand any potential risks or benefits. Lastly, Make sure to have your child's height checked regularly if they are using this medication for an extended period of time. When using rhinocord allergy aerosol, spray with pump, it's important to be aware of potential drug interactions. Certain medications may affect how rhinocord works or increase the risk of serious side effects. It's essential to keep a list of all the products you use, including prescription and non-prescription drugs, and herbal products, and share it with your doctor and pharmacist. Do not make any changes to your medication dosage without consulting your doctor. Be sure to carefully read the labels of all prescription medications, 
as other corticosteroids like prednisone may increase the risk of side effects when taken with rhinocort. If you have any questions about your medications, don't hesitate to ask your doctor or pharmacist. Always follow their recommendations for the best results. If someone has taken too much rhinocord allergy aerosol, spray with pump and is experiencing severe symptoms like fainting or difficulty breathing, it's important to seek immediate medical help. In the U.S., you can call your local poison control center at 1-800-222-1222. In Canada, residents can call a provincial poison control center for assistance. It's important to keep all regular medical and lab appointments while using rhinocord allergy aerosol, spray with pump. If you use this medication for an extended period of time, your doctor may want to conduct nose exams and measure your height, if you're a child, to monitor its effects. Be sure to consult your doctor for more details. In addition, it's essential to avoid substances that can worsen allergy symptoms, such as pollen, pet dander, dust mites, mold, and smoke. Paying attention to these triggers can help you manage your allergies more effectively. If you forget to use rhinocord allergy aerosol, Spray with pump on your regular schedule, use it as soon as you remember. If it's close to the time of your next dose, just skip the missed dose and continue with your regular schedule. Don't take a double dose to make up for the missed one. The recommended daily dosage for adults is usually 1 to 4 sprays in each nostril once a day. It's best to use it at the same time each day to help you remember. When storing rhinocord allergy aerosol, spray with pump, Make sure to keep it at room temperature and away from light and moisture. Always keep the protective cap in place and store the container upright. It's important to keep all medications out of reach of children and pets. When it comes to discarding the product, do not flush it down the toilet or pour it into a drain unless specifically instructed to do so. Instead, properly discard the product when it is expired or no longer needed. You can consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company for guidance on how to do this. Remember, it's important to handle medications responsibly to ensure the safety of everyone in your household. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.